Hi everyone, I am Zubair Hassan. Hope you all are fine. Today we will talk about research, meaning of research, what actually the research means. So, dear friends, let's start the discussion about our topic, the meaning of research and the meaning of educational research. As you know, uh, as of being beginner in education, there is the biggest confusion and a necessary to know the meaning of research and the meaning of education research. Research and education research, these are the two midterm concepts which are very necessarily to make the understanding of these two things. So dear friends, let's start first the meaning of research. If we talk about the meaning of research, what does it mean? The meaning of research, it means the systematic investigation into a study of materials. Research means the systematic investigation into a study of materials and sources in order to establish facts, in order to establish facts and reach new conclusions. Means the systematic investigation. Systematic investigation means uh, the study in scientific nature into a study of materials scientific study we can say systematic investigation the study based on logic and sources about materials scientific study about materials we can say scientific study about the sources scientific study about the things scientific study about the uh, any objects we can say any study about the things materials and objects done scientifically which will establish new facts and reach out new conclusions we can say is called research so there is a definition biggest definition used everywhere in the world about the meaning of the research for making proper understanding of the meaning of the research that is Kerlinger. You may be have known of the person, psychologist, scientist, and big researcher Kerlinger 1986. What he has said about research research is a systematic, controlled, empirical and critical investigation of hypothetical proportions about the presumed relations among natural phenomena means research is systematic systematic means based on logic controlled controlled means on which an observer or we can say investigator or researcher has a control on his subject, on his study, on which he are going to conduct research. And research is empirical. Empirical means which can be verified and observed. Also, it can be verified and which can be observed. And critical investigation. Critical means based on the question why. Or we can say criti critically. If we talk about the critically, word means descriptive in nature and analytically descriptively and uh, analytically uh, which mainly are articulated on the words on the spoken words on in the form of oral form spoken form or we can say artistic expressions this is critical investigation of hypothetical proportions hypothetical proportions means based on the ideas which has been generated in the mind of researcher or based on the ideas based on the research questions which has been developed in the mind of the investigator about the study uh, about the presumed relations of hypothetical proportions about the presumed relations what hypothetical proportions Hypothetical proportions about the presumed relations of the study means 
those gases the gases are related to the study which the researcher get in his mind about the study among natural phenomena which naturally occurred we can say when a researcher starts to study something about materials or we can say about source, sources empirically critically or we can say in a systematic manner huh? generally he has uh, many ideas which uh, are generated in his mind uh, with his presumed relations of the subject of the material and or any objects so this was the meaning of research so dear friends now we will know the meaning of educational research basic concept of education research and this was the basic concept of education research i hope you got proper understanding of the meaning and concept of research so another the meaning and concept of educational research what does educational research means as of being uh, the students or we can say of scholars in the subject education we it's necessarily to know the meaning of research and make differentiation in research and educational research so it is very important and necessary for us to have the meaning and difference of these two things research and educational research so educational research educational research when we talk about now education research education research science systematic field of study education research is similarly we can say systematic field of study in last in research we uh, uh, discussed systematic investigation of things materials and sources and here we can say education research similarly systematic but field of study systematic field of study that examines education and learning process that examines education and learning processes and the human attributes and interactions and organizations and institutions means education research is scientific field of study that examines education and learning processes and the human attributes interactions organizations and institutions that shape educational outcomes and further we can say educational research is systematic application of scientific methods to the study of educational problems patterns and systems generally reach out its proper understandings so means education research is scientific field of study study on his field of education scientifically you have no uh, before scientifically means scientific in nature means means systematic analysis the analysis systematically scientifically when we talk about when we uh, read the word scientific that means systematically when we read a word systematic we can say this is logical this is scientific in nature go every uh, study in research we can say when we talk about the meaning of the research when we talk about the concept of the research so we can say study in scientific manner in the field of study that examines education we can say education research means that study which will examine education which will examine education and learning processes for example i can make you understand like the study that will make or that will examine education the system of education the organization of education the processes of education the ongoing activities in education the development in education the process in education and learning processes how before the students learned 
uh, and how now today the students can learn more uh, can learn uh, more easily can make understood more easily and they can have many researches about teaching learning in education and the human attributes so you can say education research is the study related to the human attributes humans in society attributes of human in society and we can see um, uh, their interactions and we can say the organizations organizations of anything organization and uh, we can say educational organizations and institutions like schools colleges and universities the study about schools the study about colleges the study about universities when we talk about the study about schools what and how uh, the education system is going on in uh, today's schools how the education system is going on in today's colleges and universities how the education is developed we can have comparative study also uh, about education about colleges and universities in one state into another state in one country into another country to make a good comparison related to or we can say related in the field of education related the field of education related the study of education related the development of education related the progress of education related the learning processes uh, as you know the study in education we can say learning of private schools learning of uh, we can say government schools learn teaching learning process in private schools teaching learning process processes in government schools teaching learning process is one state teaching learning process is another state teaching learning process is one country we can say underdeveloped teaching learning process is underdeveloped country and teaching learning processes in developed countries we can have comparison also in the field of education when we talk about the educational research so uh, it means that the study that will shape education outcomes the study that will shape educational outcomes we can say is called educational research and education research is systematic application we can say education research is systematic application in the application of things knowledge concepts of scientific methods to the study of educational problems to the study of education problems and also we can say the study of education problems the study of educational patterns and the study of education systems when we talk about education research we can say the study of educational problems the study of educational patterns and the study of educational systems generally reach out its proper understandings so this was the concept of education and we can make it uh, more understanding by a very well defined definition by Strauss 1984 what he has asked about education research he has written education research is defined as systematic activity that is directed at providing knowledge or understanding of existing knowledge which is of relevance for improving the effectiveness of education systematic activity that is directed at providing knowledge or understanding of existing knowledge we can say education research there is provision of new knowledge and understanding of existing knowledge as uh, you may be our remembering the last lecture uh, the if we talk about the understanding of existing knowledge, the understanding of existing before developed theories, understanding which has already developed in education, use it everywhere for making the good understanding of the things. We can say educational research is for making the proper understanding and clear understanding of existing knowledge which has been already developed in education, which is of relevance which is of relevance for what? For improving the effectiveness of education, for 
improving for making the development of education for making the progress of education for making the effectiveness of teaching and learnings so friends this was all about the meaning and concept of research i think ki this topic is very important and interesting for everyone as all well, the learner and uh, the student of subject education hope you got proper understanding and clear uh, concepts of these two things thank you